This is Dwan Sanders, defensive coordinator here at Virginia State University. I'd like to take some time to talk a little defensive play with you. Uh, we employ the 425 here at Virginia State University, but first I'd like to talk about the numbering system, how we number our gaps. It is so important, especially when you got the newer guys coming in camp, those true freshmen don't really understand the gap system. So let's go ahead on and attack this first. All right, make sure when you throw, draw your, your line up there, make sure that you have enough room and space in between so they can understand and it's not all cluttered up. To become a great football coach, you must be an awesome educator. So we have to make sure that we get it clear and make sure we concise when we're talking with the kids. All right, number one, head up on this guy is a zero technique. All right, on the outside shade, of that center is a one technique that exists all the way through the gap. You have to make sure that you know that it covers the whole entire gap. Now, inside shade of the guard is what we call a two eye. Everything is mirrored. So that two eye is the inside shade of the guard. Head up on the guard is a two technique. Okay, outside shade is a three technique. Now there goes that gap again, guys. That gap exists all the way through until we get to the inside shade of the tackle. Again, that go the word I meaning inside again. So that what we got is a four I right here. Four I. All right, now when you go head up on that tackle, you have what we call a four. Outside shade of that tackle is a five. Okay, when we get to the tight end, make sure that you know that five will exist all the way through the gap. All the way through the gap. Now we're gonna get to what we call the inside shade of the tight end. Now that numbering system has been different for over many years. I've always employed the seven shade being the inside shade of your tight end. Head up on your tight end is a six. Outside shade of your tight end is a nine technique. So everybody say, where is the eight there? There is an eight and it does exist. When that tight end gets up, transfers over, that end can back off of the LOS and consider himself in a ghost eight. And that technique will most definitely take care of the seven, nine, and the six because the tight end is left. Now we have an eight. 